Hey everyone, today is day 33 of distance learning and we are in the final session. There are only, gosh, a handful of weeks left. Um, it's been a little while since I made a video of the day for you. So today I wanted to make a video of the day uh, about our new music theory review lessons. So here we go. First thing I want to show you is the championships menu. Okay, the thing that most of you know really, really well. If you scroll down to the menu, you'll find the new links to everything in the literacy section in the second box that says complete a theory lesson. But I wanted to walk you through also um, how to access it through Google Classroom because I'm putting everything on Google Classroom now. So on Google Classroom, you'll click on classwork right up here and then you'll see something that says music theory lesson click on that as soon as you open that you'll be able to access everything you need to to complete this lesson so let's go through the steps the first step in one window so you're going to be using two different windows open the document below so scroll to the bottom click on that It'll open up in a new tab. <laughs> Go back to Google Classroom. And this is all the same on the championship menu as well. So um, nothing's really different. Then you'll go here and click on a musictheory.net lesson. Okay, you'll notice that all the lessons pop up. And this one's being a little bit slow. There we go. Okay. So, step number three. Choose one of the following lessons to complete. You'll notice that all of these right here line up with exactly one of these first seven lessons. Okay, so let's, let's decide. Great, I'm going to choose the first one. Okay, now let's go back to the steps. Fill out the note taking sheet. That was the first one that we opened. <laughs> okay, um, and that for some reason is still loading. So, hint, hint, I give you a little hint here. It's easier if you do things with split screen view. So what you can do is take this tab, highlight it. So this is the theory lesson one. Drag it all the way over to the side. It will create its own window at half of it, right? Then you're going to click on the same thing that we were just on to split the screen again. Okay, so now I have both side by side. And what you're going to do for this theory lesson, it's a review. So it's kind of kind of busy work, but that's okay. Make sure you put your name, put your date, class period. What theory lesson did you complete? So here's the title of that. And then you're going to want to copy each line. So here you would put the staff is the foundation upon which Notes are drawn, okay? And then you would click on the next one and complete that one. Notice that it changes on your screen. It changes what you're looking at so you can see exactly what it's highlighting. And then you would click to the next one, type that, and then finally you get to the bottom and you would type each one of those lines out. Okay, so for some of you, you would have to you would have to add an extra number just by hitting return after you um, complete that line. So you're completing each one of these lines. Um, then you would go down here and find all the bold words. Okay, so first one is right here, staff. Hit enter. What would be the next one? Ah, clefs. 
enter and then you would find every bold word and then the final one is grand staff and then you would pick out three things you learned um, notice that it says here they could be things that you already know that maybe you forgot about um, so maybe you don't know a lot about the grand staff you could put that in there as soon as you're done with this then you would turn it in in Google Classroom the same way that you turn in all the rest of your work. Um, so I think it's pretty straightforward. Um, it won't hopefully take you too much time. Um, so it's a really awesome way to earn a lot of points. Um, for every lesson that you complete, it's 50 points. There are seven lessons, so you can earn up to 750 points. Um, remember that we are still doing the hat pool each week. We skipped a couple of weeks because uh, things were a little busy and I forgot to do some videos of the day. But this is my hat this week. It's kind of plain. It doesn't have a, a baseball team on it. But um, just describe it if this ends up being the, the day of the week for the hat pool. So have an awesome evening and complete those music theory lessons.